I tend to meet my patients when they come in for their annual exam and we do pap smears and birth control and if there's any problems that crop up with anything like that, they can come and see me about it. Um, I'm able to provide my patients with some really good surgical options as well uh, and to sort of follow them through that and then to keep doing you know, annuals and checking in and see how things are going. Robotics has a, has a wonderful set of advantages. It is minimally invasive with small incisions and quick recovery. Instead of seeing sort of a two-dimensional like on a television screen, it is three-dimensional. And robotic instruments are wristed, which allow the robot arms to do anything that I can do with my hands. And it's, uh, it's a great way to do complicated surgery with great precision uh, and to provide really good outcomes for our patients. Because most of what I do is about quality of life, no one is in a better position to tell me about what will make the quality of their life better than the patient. So I don't believe in a one-size-fits-all approach. Any, any decisions about surgery, about hormones, about medication, about observation is always going to be made looking at the patient's entire life situation. My husband is also a physician. He's a stroke neurologist. And my son is 18 months and my daughter is four. Uh, and they definitely keep me busy, but they also keep things in perspective, which is wonderful. There aren't very many doctors that can have meaningful relationships with patients throughout the life cycle like that, and it's, it's wonderful. I really enjoy it.